Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So yes, it's that time again. Time to take up another champion, and this one's gonna be a six star to rank three. And if you think you can guess who I'm about to take up, leave a comment below and let me know what your guess is. But we're about to reveal it in five, four, three, two, one. Immortal Abomination. All right, so while I'm taking him up, I'm going to talk to you about my last crystal opening. All right, so here we go. And Immortal Abomination is now my newest rank three. And you'll notice that he is not awakened. Okay, so if you haven't watched my uh, last crystal opening, what happened is that I got a nexus. And in that nexus, I had two new champions, uh, Symbiote Supreme and Mangog. And I also had Immortal Abomination that I could have awakened. Now, he is on my list as one of the champs that I want to awaken the most. But I went for a new champion. And it hurt. But I wanted to explain a little bit why I did that. And I'm still taking him up. I run suicides. Okay? Or the ouchie masteries, as some people refer to them. And with those, it's arguably better to have him unawakened. Now, if you're not running the ouchie masteries, then you really want him awakened. So that is kind of, let me grab a few of these. That is kind of what was behind my decision not to awaken him when I could have, even though I knew I was going to be taking him up. Now, I would have done this last level up, but I forgot. I actually missed the entire level up. I didn't level up a single champion during that level up. So I've been waiting for four days for this level up so I could take him up. Uh, and you can see I have no tier five basic catalyst left. Okay, now I did buy that uh, romance bundle that uh, had a two to three rank up gem in it. And soon we're going to have Kitty Pride in the basic arena. And I'm going to want to grind for her. And that way I have a way to take her to rank three to get the T5 basics and, and other um, resources. I need to start doing content. So that's what I'll be doing. You know, I'll be doing uh, working on variant eight, working on uh, seven point act seven point two and seven point three. Probably not going to be doing the abyss still. All right. So let's uh, take this guy out for a spin. We already took him out for a spin before when I took him to rank two. Let's see what's changed. And we may do a couple of fights uh, with him. So let's head into uh, Realm of Legends and smack around some folk. All right, we're gonna head in here. This is the team that I decided to go in with. I basically threw in just a bunch of synergies. Let's take a look real quick. Um, so these are the synergies that he has active. Um, personal poison and acid burn effects gain 15% potency, so that's more damage. Heavy attacks inflict an armor break debuff. Uh, for 15 seconds, we also have basic attacks required to trigger a self-poison or reduce by two. And we have more critical rating. Okay, so let's go ahead in here. And I'm actually going to fight Winter Soldier, but I'll also fight Captain Marvel because she's poison immune. And I don't think I did that the last time. All right, so uh, what I'm going to do here is I'm going to build up to a special three, fire that off, and then 
I'm going to try to build up to a special two. And fire that off. All right. Look at the damage. He is a beast. See, I hate this passive AI. But just look at his health. All right. Let's go ahead and uh, fire off that special three. I could skip it, but I'm going to just let it play. I've had some issues where it comes back and uh, it comes back quick and I get hit before I can even move. And so I'm, I'm not going to do that right just yet. All right. So now that I've gotten the uh, special three off, I'm going to build up to that special two. Health still at a yellow bar, y'all. Okay, here's the special. All right, now I got that acid burn up. And now you can see the damage. Just look at that damage. Fire off a special one. That damage is nasty. Look at that. And I'm running suicides. And I just ran, uh, you know, fired my special off. But I'm not really suffering from a lot of health loss, as you can see. Come on. Fire off another special two. And look at his health. Look at my health. Crazy. Finish him. And how did we finish the fight? What health did we finish this fight with? Firing off special two, two special twos, special one, running suicides, the recoil damage. However, what did we finish with? Pretty good, I say. All right. Now, this is uh, a poison immune. And I wanted to do this fight so you guys could see. Uh, how he does against a champion who is poison immune. And I, when I first started uh, fighting with him, I thought that this would be horrible. You know, a lot of his damage is just not there, right? So we're going to do the same thing we did in the uh, first fight. We're going to build up to a special... Uh, okay, I don't know why he just ran forward like that. Um, we're going to build up to a special uh, three. And then we're going to fire off the uh, special two. All right. Here we go. Okay, this time I will skip it. You see, I was blocking almost immediately. Because I've had some shenanigans. But just look at this. And I haven't even gotten to my special two yet. But she's immune, or else she would be hurt even more than this. All right, now, special two. And let's see. That acid burn is nasty. I don't know. Okay. She's got half her health left. Fire off another special. Whoop. I don't know if this is the right way to play against a poison immune. You know, it's a longer fight. But doesn't seem to be that bad. Got three acid burns up, I think, or, or uh, I think that's acid burns up. Okay, so now it's gone. Definitely a longer fight. Absolutely a longer fight. Let me see. But look at his health. It's a longer fight, but... I mean, really? 
That's still impressive. Look at that damage. That special three did a lot of damage. Okay. Ooh. And done. Definitely a longer fight against a poison immune, but look at his health. He is very tanky. Okay. Um, one of these days, I'll do the fight. I don't really feel like uh, going all the way up to uh, Wolverine uh, right now, but uh, he's going to do the Wolverine fight really, really well. I'll, I'll make a video where I do work my way up to him and then uh, put it out for you guys. But that's going to do it. Thank you all for watching the video. Let me know what you think about Immortal Abomination. Do you like him? Uh, what do you think about my decision to rank three him, even unawakened, though I'm running suicides? What say you? Take care, and you all have a blessed day.